wonder what I need to make next. Probably the cabling. Let's see. Okay. 24 blue alloy ingots left. Let me see. Probably gonna need to do brass at some point, because I know I'll need plenty of brass to make the pneumatic tubes. Um, let me see. Where is the retriever? Because I know I need to do that. Retriever. Filter. So I need filter. Probably gonna need a couple of those, so let's build. Yeah, let's build four filters. So four pistons. Red doped wafer is just that. So I'm gonna need. Let me think here. Eight sand at least. So yeah, let's do forty-eight. And let's see how much coal or charcoal as it should say would that be? Yeah, let's just do that and that and they'll figure it out. And that will go into red doped wafers. I believe I said I need five pistons. Look. Let's see. Filter. Yeah. I want a sorting machine and two retrievers. Yeah, so that's three pistons. So I'll just build three for the moment. Let's see if I need more. Although I suppose I could just take the two I've already got. Build one retriever, one sorting machine. Yeah. Okay. That's what I'll do then. So I'll need a bit of leather, two ender pearls, brass, iron, blue alloy. Eh, that. Got all that. So I just need a bit of gold. There we go, keep it even. Alright, so I come over here. This should be done, yeah. Uh, so it's... Oh, alright, I need eight charcoal. It's an odd recipe, but I guess it makes sense. Eight and eight. Okay. Four silicon bools. So like that, and like that. Oh, good. Sixty-four wafers. That's good. So then, I believe it was just mixing with redstone. Hmm. Don't think I'll need all that many, so I'll just do eight. Because the red doped wafers are only used with that? Really? Hm. I guess it makes sense. So I guess one, two, three, four, five, six. So yeah, eight's all I'd ever need. Really. Alright, so I'll let that do that. In the meantime, I can, now that I have one, I can do that. I believe I said I wanted two of these? Yeah, one for the retriever, one for the sorting machine. So I need two red doped wafers. And I now have, in a second here, two red doped wafers. Alright. So now. That recipe is cobblestone with gold. So I go gold, cobblestone, that, and that to make a filter. I only have enough gold for one. So I'm going to have to do that again. Gold, cobblestone, red doped wafer, where'd that piston go? 
filter. Good. Now, filter. Need brass for that, so let's do that one. One blue aloe ingot, the rest iron. Now let's grab all of it. And wrong button. Yeah, five iron, one blue alloy, two red doped wafers. And it looks like they're done, so that's good. Okay, sorting machine. Now for brass, I'm gonna need a bunch of brass. So let's see, copper tin. Three to one makes four. So let's just make a. S let's see. It'd probably end up being four stacks. Sure. Alright, so three stacks copper, one stack tin. Should do the trick nicely. And I'll have plenty of brass and never need to worry about brass again. Oh, looks like I already got that. I'll put that back. I'll try to at any rate. Grab that. Put that there. That there. I, mean, I might as well do something with all this tin that I've tin and copper that I've got, right? Okay. In a moment, that will come through, and I'll be able to throw it in there. Charcoal. Charcoal's doing okay. Okay. sorting machine. Let's see, I was going to build... Yeah. So I'll need brass for that. That's why I'm doing this. Okay. Yeah. So now we smelt all this stuff up. Like so. Okay, now that's done. So I can grab the stuff here. Like so. And then this one here has the most charcoal, I think, so I'll just put all this stuff like so. Actually. There. Is that right? No. Or I think I I think I miscalculated. I think I should have, in fact, had a bit more. There you go. That should be enough. So I'll just quickly smelt that. Grab that. Put that up there. It's already done. Very nice. Like that. And then like that. That should turn into lots and lots of brass. Pull some of this charcoal out and put it over here. And now with that I'm able to see if I remember the recipe. Brass filter, ender pearl, leather, hmm. I'm probably really, really close. Uh, okay, what was it? Oh, didn't actually use the red doped wafers, alright. So I just do that, that, and like that, and then there, and there, 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 there. Retriever. Okay. Very good, very good. That's still making tons and tons of that stuff. I can put my buckets away, I suppose. Okay, so now what? Let me 
see. I've got the retriever, sorting machine. I'm gonna have plenty of pipes. Because pipes are just brass and um, glass. I've got the sorting machine. Looks like I'm ready to go actually build an um a sorting setup. So that's good. Sort that like that. Still don't know what to do with that tungsten ore, but alright. Um I suppose I can put most of the stuff away now. Let's see, sand goes in here. Yeah, let's keep that. Okay. Oh, blue wires. That's what I was gonna need. Knew I was creating something. Um it's just wool around alloy ingots. So how many do I have? Twenty two. 22 doesn't really divide by 3. Makes 7, so... Well, yeah, 21. Let's see, that'd that be a lot. I'll only do 12. Because I don't need... a ton. And I don't actually have all that much wool. Okay, so this like I'll only do that much, but that should be enough. That twenty-four blue alloy wire. So that's good. And then I'll go ahead and Let's see, before I do that, is brass used for anything in particular? Let's see. Lots of recipes for making it, but other than an item detector, which is two pieces, retriever, two pieces, mostly just for the piping. Alright, so I'll go ahead and spend a stack to make however many. Wow, okay. Four stacks of piping. <laughs> Alright. And then I'll put the rest. Right there, and there, and I can go ahead and put that there, I need to keep that, put that there, that there, I need to keep these things, yeah, awesome, okay, sorting machine, ooh, actually, <laughs> I know what I need to build, I need to build some stuff because I need to. That will make them run, or that will power them. But I need to build the thing, the some redstone stuff, to get them to actually run. So let's see here. Set item. Redstone. I need redstone timer. Oh yeah, I'm gonna need. Paintbrushes and paint too. I'm at it. Let's see here. Um, here we go. Timer. Right. I have no idea whether I'm going to need to build one or two. I'll start with one. Looks like I need to do that three times, that a couple times, but to do that I'm gonna need stone wafers. Yeah. Alright, so let's just build a bunch of stone wafers real fast. Incidentally, I'm uh, currently I have no plans to um, either refit any of the redstone that I've done so far with the improved redstone or do future redstone with it except for obviously 
using the timers and whatnot. Um, this is mostly simply because I don't really want to do the stuff with the mod because the whole idea of the complicated redstone wiring I've done is that it's um, vanilla compatible. Oh wait, it's doing that. In that case, well, I'm just going to do that. I see, so you smelt it, you get two. That makes sense. Keep that, actually I'm gonna need those. Thank you. And then I believe I need like that. Okay. So I need to do three of those. Let's start like that. And then I need to do that once. And then I need two torches. Right. So I go like that and like that. Two torches like that, like that, and one of those and then stone pointer and stone cathode. Then I think if I re can let's see, I don't remember the recipe. So wafers, wires, pointer and cathode, anode. And it's a complicated recipe. Anode, anode, wire, 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 wafer, wafer, cathode, pointer, timer! Yay! Now I'm going to need some wiring to connect this. Red alloy wire is just three red alloy ingots. Red alloy ingots are just... are just... <laughs> somewhere. There, eight, eight, there. Iron and redstone. Alright, so... Let's just make a stack of them and be done with it. Okay, I'm gonna stop this. That's way too much brass. Come to think, it's probably way too much redstone as well. There, I'll make 16. These can go in here as well. Timer. So we've got tin that can go in there. Alright. This looks like it will be done shortly. In the meantime, I've got that. Yeah, because it makes that, so that's a lot. Alright. Now. I think I can only grab one more thing, although actually I think it's already there. Okay. I think... Oh wait, I've got something. What is this? Iron ingot. Okay, well let's put the iron ingot so that's kind of where they belong. That. Grab that. Put that in there. And that there. Okay. Okay, I am ready. I think. <laughs> Alright. So. Oh yeah, I was going to have painter. Well, let's just 
put down what I've got so far and see what happens. Okay, this is full, excellent. So let me get out my blue alloy wire. Good, that looks like it's connected, awesome. So then let me just, let's see, actually if I do that, will I actually still be able to get up here? Yes, good. All right, so let me just run this like this. put the regular retriever, I should say, right here. Okay, it looks like it connected good. Now, I don't know which side's the input or the output, but we'll find out quickly enough. Okay, piping. Let's just start by doing this. Confirm that it can pull successfully. So we'll put this here. Let's see. I think I should probably actually do that so that this can go like this. Okay, looks like it needs to get reoriented. It works. Awesome. That's not so awesome. That's okay. I'll just rearrange where the wire comes in. or something down to stop that. Lever. That. There. There. So now this will connect to that. So now I just have to connect it to all the chests. In theory, it should work. I wonder if this thing has an effective range. But we'll soon find out. that chest and that chest. I think that's all the chests I wanted to pull stuff out of. And let's see, it's all garbage, so I suppose I can just send it all towards the recyclers. Hmm. Don't want it actually to connect to that chest. Need to move that chest anyway, so. There. Now I just need to wire power to those things. And let's see, where do I have a. Hmm. So, okay, I'm going to. 
quick here. Do that so nothing can get. Oh wait, no, it's you tell me. No, I did this wrong. Okay, hold on. That pipe can stay, but oh no, this is the pulling out pipe. Never mind. So I did this right after all. Okay, so that connects. This is all good. So actually, that should hold them from going in. Okay, so let's turn this on and see what happens. Stuff's going through. Things there. Goes in there. They're turning on because they've got a bit of power left in them. stuck at 64 and so once they get stuck can't turn around there it goes back in but it stops pulling out all right it's not a hundred percent ideal but I think it should work so let me that's the one I passed. I heard 5.5 is a good one Alright, so we'll turn that off for the moment. Now I just need to rewire power to the recyclers. Put all this stuff back in the chests. Let's see. Okay. And. I'll just pull it from here. Oh yeah, I'm gonna need... something to pull them out again. Shouldn't be too hard. I'll just go and build a second, um, whatchamacallit, uh, retriever, and I'll use that. Oh, okay, wait, that's the uh, room up there. Okay. Okay, so let me just. Put that there. Ah, lagged. Okay, like that. I think being in close close proximity to my um, water room causes a bunch of lag because I seem to lag a lot. And it was fine once the caves started getting all right. The caves once the caves were fully loaded, they were fine. But then I come back here and it's lag again. So, eh, whatever. It's not unplayable. So, alright, I'm gonna put the LV transformer right about here. And then that looks good. Put that down. Okay, high voltage, medium voltage in there, low voltage over there. Connect. Nothing exploded, everything turned on. And up, oh, yep, see, there comes the backlog stuff. Which may or may not actually get anywhere. Depends. So it tops them off. And it just sort of bounces around a bit. Hopefully, with the five of them, they should mostly stay over here. Yeah, bouncing back and forth until they're all filled up. My only concern is that the retriever will keep sending in f stuff, so I'll end up with like a bajillion stone in the 
tubes, but as long as it doesn't despawn, should be fine. So now I just need to tweak this a bit because it's kind of in my way. Put some tubes on the front, which I can actually do that right now. Now that I've done that, I think I'll do it like that, put a retriever here, and then just feed it right in the chest. This one. So like that, and that, and, and until I can start painting them, I'll just stick with uh, not letting them connect. Let's see, I'm going to need electricity power over here as well. I need to move that chest. And I'm out of electricity wire. Hmm. Wonder. Hmm. Wonder how I'm going to I think I should move the timer to there. Because then once the timer is there... Oops, wrong button. There. There we go. So if the, if the timer is here, and set it to the... 5-5 five, five delay there, then I can put the lever there, like so, and then I can put the electricity power straight underneath there, at least in th for now. So I suppose I could put it here, and that would save me, the yeah, okay. Alright, but I need to go get the rest of my wool. And then I'm probably going to end up shearing my sheep a lot, just to keep the, um, electricity, not electricity, blue light, uh, electricity, uh, blue alloy wire. <laughs> Alright, so I've got enough for another 12, so I'll make that work for now. Actually, can I use that light gray wool as well? Because that would be cool. No, I did that wrong. Okay. So that's 25. Um, I'll grab my shears while I'm in here. And then I'll miss make a mental note to shear my sheep at some point soon. Okay, so let's... I don't have any stone on me, so I'll fix that later. Oh yeah, regulator. Or not regulator, retriever. I'll pick that back up. Some iron. Retriever, here we go, retriever. Filter and that stuff. Interesting. So it's it was going between those two. <laughs> ah well. So yeah, I'll run the electricity power to there. Like so.
So now it'll run that regulator, and then it'll all the way go all the way over here and run that regulator. Oh, uh, regulator. Retriever. I keep saying regulator. I don't know why. Alright, so I need some iron. Let's see, let's build three more, because they're, um, they're unlikely to be building a bunch more of these. So... Okay. And then I need six ender pearls. Twelve brass, six leather. Okay, and then I need to fill the sticky pistons. I wish you could unsticky a piston, that would be useful. Um, so that's going to be... Oh, I don't know, three pieces? Yeah, three pieces of that. And I've already got three pieces of that. I need cobblestone. Okay, and then I've got the wood. Right. I think that's everything I need to cut the brass, which is right here. Okay. So let's see if I can remember this. That, like that, and that, and then I'm not going to have enough wood. That's unfortunate. Wrong one. Um, that and that. There. Three pistons. Pistons. That. Guess I only need three, but alright. Like that. There, there. And then. Like that. What? Oh. I need to make the filter first. Right. Retriever is good, but you need to make the filter, which is the three pistons, three red doped wafers. Okay. And now, of course, I missed something. That was it this time. Oh, yeah, the gold. <laughs> so I need what? Six? Six. Alright, so let's try this again. Uh, three pieces like that. And that, that, that. That, that, that. Ah, awesome. Filters. Then... That, 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 ha! Retrievers, yay! Man, my inventory is a mess. But now I've got another three retrievers, so that's one here, and then two more as I need them. Okay. So I want the input to face the machines. Like that. Good. Don't need to worry about painting or anything like that. Now I just need to figure out how I'm going to get the power to it. Huh. Um... Guess I run a parallel wire. But in theory, this will be the full setup. 
and it will work great. <clears throat> I think I'll just crawl it up the block like that. I suppose I can't. Yeah, you can't do that. And then I'll just squeeze it around like that. Perfect. Okay, so now that should run. Pull these out. These sorted through all their stuff, it looks like. While dumping more stuff in. Alright, so let's give this a try. If this works, I'm going to be so happy. Go. Okay, stuff's coming in. And stuff's coming out. Awesome. Don't really like how it's over that. I'll, at some point, I think I'll crawl underneath. Act well, I'll just do that right now. Any scrap that gets produced is immediately pulled out. Cycle is running at full tilt. We'll keep that stuff going. And it looks like the retriever is smart enough to realize that they're holding the inventory and will probably only periodically send more items. Yeah, retriever. We have a black. Ah, there it go. Black. Doesn't really do anything though. Cause I don't have any painting set up. Ideally, you could then use it to figure out where the stuff goes, but. So now. We'll presumably. Pull everything out. And, uh. Yeah. So now that that's running effectively. I think the next thing to do is to tweak the config file and get this thing to turn off. Ah, much better. Alright, so now that will run silently. And it won't drive me insane. And it should, in theory, eventually work its way through everything and it re speed everything recycled. So now, I think I'm actually going to stop the recording now and... Massive lag here and let it run for a while and then I think I'm also going to sort out I guess I don't need this anymore the um how I'm going to do this because this chest here connects to the buildcraft pipe down there and what I'm thinking is that this will be the converter from buildcraft pipes to red, so red power pipes and that the quarry will put stuff in this chest and then red power will pull it out and sort it so once this is all done, I'll tear all this apart and then sort it. So it comes out, it goes straight into a sorting machine, sorts all the different directions, junk goes through recyclers, um, and then I think I'll have a whole bunch of chests all labeled and dedicated. So instead of, um, where was it? Over here. You know, like this, it'll be one chest of copper, tin, coal, gravel, well not gravel, but you get my point, redstone, that sort of thing. And, yeah. So, once that finishes, then it will be good, and I'll build the sorting machine, and once the whole sorting complex is done, then I will work on moving my quarry, and setting it up again with build pipes, because I think the sorting machine is going to be here, and I've seen sorting machine, I don't mean that, I mean the sorting assembly will be in this room and I'll just connect this part to wherever it ends up being. So, Alright, so this was a good part. By the way, this is the buildcraft wrench. So buildcraft wrench, industrial craft wrench, and red power wrench. Alright, so I think this was good. So I'm going to cut the video here.
See you in the next part. Bye!